the mic. And we want to welcome you to our channel, Sunsets and Sangria, our travel diary. We, um, we're we excited to get started on this new adventure. So we have, we are sitting in our RV, we call it the Beast. It is a... <laughs> it's a, it's a <laughs> Thor Challenger 37 KT 2014 model. And, and we're sitting inside it because it's raining outside, so... We're in Maryland. It's been raining for days. And we want to go somewhere sunnier <laughs> where it's not raining yeah like arizona <laughs> which is where we're going to be going on our first trip here not our first trip well, not our very we've first had trip. our we've had an rv since 2010 2009, 2009 i think there. we've got our first one and we've had we've gone through five of them yeah, this is our fifth and <laughs> hopefully the last big one <laughs> and not gone through as like wore them out but over the years we when we started traveling our boys were young so we were out on the road with them, and we've had a bunkhouse yep. um, coach. We've had Class A's the whole time. Um, Two diesels. Yeah, we've gone through various renditions, and we finally found one that fits our lifestyle, perfect layout. And at some point in the future, we'll, we will be doing a tour of the of the RV. Yes. Um, but so this one is the one that we think will take us far down the road, and we are excited to share our adventures with you. Mm -hmm. We are at the point in our lives where our boys are out of the house. Um, we're not retired yet, but we are aiming towards retirement. So on this channel, we hope to not only share our adventures with you, but um, Mike has learned a lot about RVs over oh, yes. the course of <laughs> all these different ones and the many trips we've taken. Um, so we hope to share tips with you, travel tips, but we're also aiming towards retirement and going full time. So there will also be some discussion about what that looks like, what we have to consider as we aim towards retirement. All right, so we've got four, four years left, give or take a little bit, um, until my retirement window opens. So, and we, we've also spent a lot of time on the road um, in previous years. I was writing books for a living, um, not to make a plug for the books, but... Um, but they're good books. <laughs> We'll talk about that more. But I, I was able to set my own schedule, and we took long trips during the summer that ranged from six to ten weeks. Um, so we have a, a good working knowledge of what it's like to be out on the road for quite a while at a time, and that really, really appealed to us. But, um, like many of you probably, um, you're looking down the road, trying to figure out, hey, is this lifestyle for me? Or maybe you just enjoy travel, and that brings us to another thing. Um, our RVing is going to be kind of limited here. Uh, after the next two, two weeks because we're going to be moving to Hawaii as Jan said and so We're going to be sharing a lot of those adventures with you as well Lots to see and do out there. So this a lot while we will still be coming back to the mainland Hopefully a couple times a year right. to go out in the RV Take the rig out. visit my Mike's parents in, in Arizona a lot of what you're going to be seeing here in the in the near future is going to be Hawaii life <laughs> yes. and exploring everything the islands have to offer. But we just love to travel. And one thing we've learned as we experienced being out on the road in our various and sundry <laughs> RVs is it taught us how easily we can survive without a lot of stuff yes. and without a lot of space. And so over the course of a few years, we've downsized and downsized. And, um, you know, that's part of the process, too. And that's part of what we'll be sharing with you, too. Yeah. So I guess we, we found out that we really don't need a lot to be happy. Um, and we like to, to move around. We like to see different things. We like to do different things and be different places. So that's the lifestyle that we want to adopt. And, and the one we want to share with you, especially if you're thinking about, about doing that kind of thing. So we want to, you know, help, help you. Help you. So we hope you will join us on our journey. Again, our channel, Sunsets and Sangria, because we mm. love walking on the beach and seeing the sunsets, and we hope to be doing a lot of that. And, and we, we love, love drinking sangria. <laughs> <laughs> or any other type of libation that might come our way. <laughs> so we hope you will join us. I um, think we're good. Yeah. So welcome aboard, and I hope you enjoy the ride, and I guess we will see you next well, time. talk soon. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.